Good morning, everybody. We've been staying at this really neat B&B here in Nevada the last couple of days. It's just outside of Great Basin National Park. And part of this property actually butts up against the boundary line of the park. So it's a really nice place. And it's called Hidden Canyon Ranch. But I wanted to take you and show you around a little bit. Hidden Canyon Resort is 19 miles from Great Basin. You take the graded dirt road six miles into the canyon. Make sure you take the same road in and out. As you can see, our GPS wanted us to take a side road. That could either be fun or it could be dangerous out in the desert. And we decided to play it safe. And passenger cars will have no problem at all. The road is in better shape than most California freeways. Self-service is pretty much non-existent in the canyon. When we checked in, they let us know that the Wi-Fi is kind of hit and miss. We were able to connect a few times during our stay, though. There is a telephone for guests to use in the lobby of the clubhouse that's right over by the rooms where you would be staying. The grocery store in Baker is very small, just to let you guys know. But the office inside the lodge at the resort has a convenience area with refrigerated and frozen food items. They have like TV dinners and, and drinks and things like that. Plus they had chips and snacks and other necessities that you might need right there at the lodge. That made it really nice. After we checked in, we settled into our room. As you can see, our room was pretty spacious. It came equipped with a fridge, a microwave, and a convection oven. Plus it had cups and plates and silverware a coffee pot and coffee made it really convenient. The resort is located on 375 acres of property. One of the trails that they have is a dirt road that goes all the way up and ends at the boundary to Great Basin National Park. We wanted to do that, but we just ran out of time. You have to admit though, that sounds like a lot of fun. We took a short hike around the grounds. My gosh, that was loud. <laughs> we'll have to see where this trail goes. I can hear the water running. Maybe it'll take us down to the river. Oh man. He's our leader. <laughs> he's the dog that lives here. And it's like he's been leading us all along the way, showing us the sights. It's really cute. We had read online that a barbecue was available for guests to use. So we planned ahead. Our first night we came prepared with hot dogs and ready-made salads in our ice chest. On our second night, we bought one of the steaks there in the office and we barbecued it. Looks yummy. This was our breakfast selection in the morning. The main course was different each day and you can have as much as you like. I had th part of my plans thought today would um, ride the ATV for two hours in the morning. That's the only thing uh, didn't get to do that would be nice. I think it would be neat to ride up the canyon in an ATV. Serious This is uh, 30, 30 minutes from the park, 19 miles. Beautiful place to stay. So we're, we're leaving Hidden Canyon Ranch now. This has been a fun trip, hasn't it? It's been great. If you're ever in the area, 
I would suggest you check this place out. We'll catch up with you all later. Bye guys. <laughs>